the South Australian desert, this modern village is the nerve center of the new atomic proving grounds at Maralinga. Here, scientists, technicians and servicemen prepared for a new series of nuclear weapon tests. Britain's top atom scientist, Sir William Penny, directed the operations. They were designed to register the effects in the battlefield of varying explosions at different heights and distances. In the target area, trenches and shelters were manned by full-size dummies to record the amount of protection afforded from the blast. One of the four tests was an air explosion, and with conditions favorable, the valiant bomb carrier took off. Then, near zero hour, scientists of Britain, Australia and Canada checked and rechecked their instruments as the seconds ticked by. Inside 10 minutes, a Canberra bomber was flying through the familiar mushroom cloud, while far below, the massive crater can be seen in the midst of desolation. Now began the work of assessing results, as scientists, wearing protective clothing, moved into the target area. Here, in the immediate vicinity of the blast, the area shows extensive damage. In all, four devices were exploded in the series, and much valuable information has been gathered concerning the use of atomic weapons in the battlefield.